Jeez, something's going on with this. All right, so we're back, and I remember we were going to use this thing because it's garbage. And we're going to do some races in the league. Get the French garbage out of the way. Oi. We'll move on to some other stuff. Until then, let's do it. So I was just trying to do another endurance run of that awful track. And I just went, you know what, I don't feel like I'm saying I'm also kind of just had a long day at work and just like, meh. So let's just do some quick races. I'm gonna make some money, I'm gonna make some progress. Do some stuff. I'm still debating on what game I wanna actually LP next. I got a few run through my head. I'm just trying to pick something that I'm probably going to want to play. Like, as much as I would love to jump in and keep playing some more Marvel Heroes, I do just need to keep working on building up Winter Soldier in this last video out. Uh, but, eh, you know, it is what it is. This car handles really well. It's very responsive, but I wouldn't say it has a lot of grip. Yeah, you see what I mean? Not a lot of grip, but very responsive. It's got enough power to handle these idiots. Especially on this track. It's not the pits, not the pits. Like I said, responsive, but doesn't handle very well. Oi. Pancake that wall. But yeah, the car I was using was not very well suited for that track. I was trying to use the ZZ2 to get the most powerful, lightest weight car I could on that track and go freaking psycho nuts. And it does them straights, but as soon as that thing even goes anywhere near a corner, the rear end tries to kick around, even though I got the downforce cranked up through the roof on that thing. And it's proceeded to spin out so much that I was literally doing about the same lap times as my Daytona Coupe. And I was like, really? Overall, I was running about the same time. I just got burned out. I'm like, eh, I don't think do this anymore. Four wheel drift in my French tub. It's a win. Now, is this French and Italian? Because if it's also Italian, I'm going to get an Alfa Romeo because it's the quintessential cop. Meow. Kitty cat. Oh, this cat's going stir crazy in here. I, mean, I don't have a very big house, it was big enough for him. Jeez. You've been just attacking me lately, haven't you? Now I have a cat in my lap. What little lap there is. Mm-hmm. Tahiti Road. Alright. Is this just French? It's just French. There isn't a better French car. Okay, so I need, what, 295 or some junk? Is this a Renault? I think it's a Renault. Yeah, Laguna. Alright. So I need 290 something. Did I upgrade this thing all the way? Oh, there we go. Shabooms. Got the stuff we need. Let's go race.
And more Tahiti Row, just the way I like it. Because this track is easy peasy. Yeah, I got a couple of games in mind, but. I just don't know. Debating on one of two, actually, there's about four RPGs. I'm back five, well, no, four. So four I'm batting around in my head, and a couple of uh, action games I'm kind of throwing around. Lean on you, my big tub. Cross you over. Come on, come on. I know I can see speed the power department. Yeah, I don't have the transmission. This is killing me. The trick with front wheel drive cars is going as straight as possible at all times because if you're turning you're losing all of your uh, acceleration friction go, your friction to acceleration ratio goes way down this is happening here oh you can get sucked into the pits I have had that happen be really careful with that Actually, my head ain't hurting anymore. Not as much as it was. No! Way the wrong button! Quit it! Down too many times. Alright, what are we gonna do next? British. Something that's 197 horsepower is British. I got an idea. Cat, if you don't cut that out. Hey! Boy! Oh, I got too much. Alright, where is it? It's gotta be in here. It ain't. Huh. I was looking for an E type jag, but. That one there. British. I know Aston Martin will have a Lotus might. Uh, do I want the Lotus? Do I want a TVR? I'm not driving in a lawn. Gay as I'll get out. Oof, no. Uh, Elise ain't bad. Oh, yeah. Let's go for the high end at least. The 
190. Do I have Lotus Racing Green? Oh yeah. Let's do that. I like that car. It's cool. So let's go race. I just spent 60 grand on a race that's gonna win me like five, four thousand. Oh my gosh. <laughs> What am I doing with my money? I spent a million on a coupe. I'm never going to race again, I think. Oh, jeez. But it was worth it, though. Oh, God, there's a mini out here. Okay, I went in overkill mode. This car is going to dust all this stuff so bad. No weight. Great powder weight ratio. And this thing's going to look great. Look at all the minis. Minis! And MGs. Oh, jeez. Got a little carried away. A little carried away. It's ain't an off-roader. Okay, come on. That's the Minis job. There's not a lot of power in this thing. But what power does that? We'll throw this car around like crazy. And this car handles really good. Whoa! Why, why are you... What are you doing, car? What's wrong with this thing? Oh, that's right, it's mid-engine. If you lose control, you lose control of the whole thing. But it's got the best handling characteristics until you lose control. And then they try to kill you. That's why I don't like mid-engine cars. I just, I don't. I don't. What the heck are these cars even keeping up with this release? This is ridiculous. Jeez, I did not hit a wall. We're good. How's this mini keeping up with me? What the heck? It's a freaking mini! It does not have near this much horsepower! Oh gosh, what is wrong with this car? This thing's supposed to handle good. This thing is not handling good. Oh, this thing was a bust. I'm selling this piece of crap. Oh my gosh, what is wrong with this car? It's like, no front grip until it just has all the front grip, and then it throws itself around, and then it doesn't want to turn, and then it, doesn't want to, then it does want to turn, then it slides. It's got like four wheels of drift. This is the worst handling car I've got. Oh my gosh! Out of my rear. That was a lotus losing all this junk. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. Pull a desperation movement, it worked. No! No! Yes! Oh! Up yours, game. Up yours. I ain't driving that. I'm getting rid of it. That's the worst freaking car in my garage. Get the frig out. Oh, Lord, that was terrible. Do we have anything else in Britain that's worth a boot? I mean, this thing, 
right here without running my freaking Lotus. A third of the horsepower. It was out running it. <laughs> Unless. No, it wasn't that. That's that's the rally car. I don't know. How are these MGs and Minis? What? Because that was the other car that was out there. Yeah, it was that. It was an MG. How are they outrunning my Lotus? That's bullcrap. Stupid game. Alright, what's TBR got? Cerebro. Oh yeah, these are going to have way too much horsepower. <laughs> you got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. Now, I know this. Quit it, cat! Turn it, crap! See, that thing weighs a lot more. This is 71 Alon Sprint. Oh, that's not bad. That weighs 1,500 pounds. This weighs less, has more horsepower, and was slower. Explain that one to me. No, screw it. Let's go with this one. Like that right there. That's cool looking. This was the most broken car in Forza history. Absolutely broken. It had no. Well, it, it, it was its weight reduction was broken, and so people would just run it because they could reduce the weight, inject power, more power than they were supposed to be able to, and it was broke. Now, if they outrun me, this is garbage, because this car is actually pretty freaking quick. For how old it is. And they're outrunning me. There's, there's no way. Cat! Grrr! Nimble little car, though. 71. Oh, that's right, it's going to have 70s brakes. <laughs> and springs. There we go, there we go, there we go. Let's go. Gaining on them. We're in the middle of the pack. We're running right where we need to be. There we go. With them. Doing alright. That's all you have four speeds. Yep. That's all it needs. There we go. Come on, climb up that hill. Choke, 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 choke. Catch another little MG. Corner is always bad though. God, it was so bad to be in the last freaking place. Yeah, that, those corners right there are usually pretty crummy. game tonight. So we'll start driving dirtier. Oh man, I hit the frickin' wall. Great, man, but he'll get away. Look, dang it. Definitely helped. Slingshot running. 
corner like that. circuit race and this is supposed to be the easy sports come on game the load blast you Alright, well, let's go shopping for the bigger British car. So, 345 and 394. I want one of these. <laughs> uh, DB7. What about this? Mm, I could go for the James Bond car. Where's the silver? That's the silver. Got that bluish silver. DB6. DB7 Volante. It's 335. What's the difference? It's a handling package. The V8 Vantage is just overkill. But the DB7 is just gorgeous. Can I get it in, you know, I can get it in British Racing Green, but... You gotta get it in white. Or some kind of silver. Alright, well... Maybe not that. Let's see. What we got over here in the Jag? XKR. Ah, I want that so bad. XK8. It's more my style. XJR. Yeah, let's go with the let's go with the Aston because we can upgrade it. We'll go with that. A little on the heavy side, but watch this. This car's gonna be a beast. All this to win a five thousand. What? Hold on. Oh, it's got 380 horsepower. Well, we'll go for the final one then. <clears throat> okay, we'll do this one and call it a video because I'm just. Ugh. 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 Yeah, 
for weighing 4,000 pounds. It sure does handle pretty freaking good. Look at that. I'm sorry, the DB6, as beautiful as that car is, is a piece of freaking crap. How is that thing even trying to keep up with this? like a freaking car. What is wrong with this stuff? I have to sit here and dump all this money into these freaking cars just to win these freaking races? This is garbage. Well, we can tell which series are not balanced in this game. This is how Japanese or American came to win it. Look at this. What's, how is the DB6 outrunning me? It's a DB6! I'm lucky to get that thing started to get it off the line. How am I driving so bad? I'm just not feeling it today. This has been just a huge epic fail night for this. I do weigh about a thousand. I got about a thousand pounds in that Lotus. So. Or oh, that's a Lister. Oh, look at Lister. That is a Lister. This thing just doesn't want to go. It's got no grunt in the engine. I mean, it's a video, I guess. Uh, hopefully, when I get up tomorrow, they don't have to work very much tomorrow. I can see actually done in this game. Besides derping it up. Or start something else, because I'm just not feeling it right now. I feel cheated since I didn't get the other car when I'm from the Seattle circuit, so it's kind of burned me out a little bit, and I tried to do it again, and the car I picked to go do that thing with was terrible bad. Kind of burned out a little bit, but yeah, that's just for this game. I'll get something going here in the next day or so. I don't know. We'll figure something out. But appreciate everybody for watching. You know, it's just a big epic fail. I mean, look at that fourth place finishes. That's the best I could do tonight. So other than a French piece of crap I was driving around in earlier. So thanks everyone for watching, and hopefully we'll get some actual races won. I just don't want to spend all the upgrades. I want to run stock cars.